off of week seven, the start of McAllen football on a Thursday night with the McAllen High School Bulldog win. I'm here with Coach Shelby. Congratulations. So let's talk a little bit about a pivoting point in the game or what was a highlight tonight? Uh, uh, there's a few highlights tonight. As a matter of fact, we, we came out and started fast. That was one of our keys to victory. You know, we talked to the guys about coming out of the locker room ready to play some football. We did sputter in the second quarter, uh, but it was good to see us come back out the second half of the football game. Uh, we made some plays defensively. We got some turnovers. And then Xavier had a good kickoff return that went to the house for a touchdown. So I think that sparked a lot of energy in us. Well, congratulations, Doubt. Tell me a little bit about what the plans are for the rest of the season. I know we have, we're a little over halfway mark. Yes, uh, no, we just tell our guys, you know, we just want them to get better every single week, you know. Uh, take it one week at a time, because it is a very tough district that we're in. So through our practice habits, our film study and so forth, if we can take it one week at a time and, and worry about the next opponent uh, and get better as a team, right? There's always things we can improve on. Uh, those are the things that we want our guys to focus on. Congratulations on your win. And also favorite coach with our region. Yeah, congratulations on that. And one more, happy birthday. <laughs> Thank you very much. I greatly appreciate it. Congratulations. We're excited to be at Jim Spirit South Party Island for the fourth annual McAllen ISD Superintendent's Fishing for Kids Tournament. It was a great turnout. I want to thank all the sponsors that came out, all the anglers. A special thank you to the McAllen Education Foundation and the Star Scholarship Fund. All the proceeds go to students in the form of scholarships. Last year we were able to team up and raise approximately $80,000. So it's another example of McAllen ISD going the extra mile for our students. So for everybody that took part, thank you so much. Welcome back, guys. We're here with Xavier Villanueva, number five. How are you? How was it with the win tonight? Uh, it felt good, yeah. Coming, uh, all the alumni coming back, putting on a show for them. It felt good. Yeah, congratulations on your win. You had a couple plays that were pretty outstanding and highlights. And I know one of those was the kickoff return touchdown. Yeah. That was awesome. But you started the game with a forced fumble. Uh, I think felt like it was like to start off the game and we really needed that momentum. I went in the locker room and I know they wanted the ball and so I felt like I had to go and take it away and give it to the offense and I felt like I did that and gave us the opportunity to score. Well, you did awesome tonight. Congratulations on your win you. and I wish you an awesome season. Tomorrow night we continue week seven for McCallum football. Our Nikki Rowe Warriors will take on our McCallum Memorial Mustangs. Fun fact. Nikki Rowe Warriors have not beat the McCallum Memorial Mustangs in a decade since 2013. So we're looking forward to that. Please tune in to our broadcast either on Facebook or YouTube channels. I'm Felicia Villarreal. See you tomorrow. Bye, guys.